Welcome. Today, we will be going through question four from the USAMA 2004. Alice and Bob play a game on a six by six grid. On his or her turn, a player chooses a rational number not yet appearing on the grid and writes it in an empty square of the grid. Alice goes first and then the players alternate. When all squares have numbers written in them, in each row, the square with the greatest number is coloured black. Alice wins if she can then draw a line from the top of the grid to the bottom of the grid that stays in black squares, and Bob wins if she can't. If two squares share a vertex, Alice can draw a line from onto the other that stays in those two squares. Find, with proof, a winning strategy for one of the players. Please pause the video here and have a think about the problem on your own before proceeding to the hints and solutions. Hint number one. There are an even number of squares in each row and column. Six squares in each row and six squares in each column. Who does this favour and why? Hint number two. What happens when Bob plays in the same row that Alice had just played on? Hint number three. A colouring proof may be a neat way to show either Alice's or Bob's winning strategy. Solution. Consider a colouring of the square as shown. Now, if Alice puts a number on a white square, Bob can choose a larger number and write it on that same row on a purple square. If Alice plays on a purple square, Bob can choose a smaller number on a white square and write it on that same row. So this way, Bob can guarantee that all the black squares will be on squares coloured purple because he will never write a larger number on a white square and he will always answer Alice's numbers on white squares with a larger number on a purple square. So looking at the placement of the purple squares, it is not possible to draw a line that stays in the purple squares and so it is not possible to draw a line from the top of the grid to the bottom of the grid that stays in black squares because all the black squares will be in the purple squares and so Alice can't win and Bob has a winning strategy. Thank you for watching. Please like and drop a comment in the comments down below if you enjoyed the video and see you next time. Goodbye.